It's the first time bus lanes have been used outside Henry Ford the second high school since the pandemic began. Inside looks very different. I'm nervous, obviously. I think anyone would be. Especially for freshman Gabe Hess in class in this school for the very first time. The face-to-face -face learning is definitely better than a computer screen. His biggest challenge so far? Not knowing where to go, mostly. Uh, it's definitely going to be different because you can't just take whatever route you want to. If, you, if I got to go next door, I got to go around the whole school. For senior Denise Druick, to be honest, she is most excited about basketball coming back. But number two on that list. I think our mental health is going to improve just getting up and actually having somewhere to go for the day. I think it's going to be awesome. The hallways are, are my main concern of crowding and being too populated. So I'm glad the arrows are there in the lunchroom. I'm a little nervous that I won't have anyone to sit by, but at the same time, I can always make new friends. As you can see, the lunchroom is socially distanced. Kids must wipe down their desk when leaving, and they've gone from three lunch sessions to five to help space things out. Of course, the hallways are a big change here in the school, but another change has to do with the passes in the hallways. Normally, you'd hand them out in the classrooms. Now it's a QR code you scan with your phone. That way you don't actually have to have those hall passes and share them back and forth. First column, first row. As for classes, they come in person two days a week online for three. And while here, they'll go to three classrooms instead of their normal six. I'm excited to get back into the building, you know, with my classmates and, you know, teachers, you know, actually see them instead of, you know, on the computer and stuff like that. And as far as wearing a mask, in this case, peer pressure is a good thing. Nowadays, I think it's just second nature almost, you know, like to wear your mask when you go out. So and if you see someone else, you're like, yo, put your mask on, you know, you know, it's it, it's definitely acceptable now. In Sterling Heights, Nick Monticelli, Local 4 News today.